In this video, we test the transmit power of the Baofeng GMRS 9R GMRS radio. Check it out. Hey guys, I'm Kevin with Kemp Outside, your inside source for all things outside. We have done a full review of our GMRS 9R radio, so I'm gonna put a link to it right up here. We really, really like these. They're waterproof radios. We use them a lot when we're out camping, hiking, fishing with our family. Anytime we're outside and we don't have cell phone service, we use these GMRS 9R waterproof radios an awful lot, especially if we know we're gonna be in bad weather. But when we created our review video, we didn't have an efficient way of testing the power output of these guys on camera. Now that I have some testing equipment, I wanted to include that for you so that you can decide whether or not this radio is right for you. If it is, I'm gonna put an affiliate link down below where you can pick up one of these radios for yourself. And guys, like I said, I really like these. Let's get right into the power test. Okay guys, so we have the GMRS 9R from Baofeng hooked into our Shorecom power meter, transmitting into a dummy load so the signal's not going anywhere. And right up here, this is where you're gonna to look to see the transmit power. We're gonna start on GMRS channel one, the radio's set to high power. And as you can see, it looks like the radio is putting out about three and a half watts. Let's go up to Two, three, four, five. GMRS channel five, and we'll test it out. And as you can see, still about three and a half watts, 3.46. All right, let's run up to GMRS channel eight. Now remember channels eight through 14 are limited to a half a watt on GMRS. Six, eight, nine, eight. So here's GMRS channel eight. And let's go ahead and transmit and see what we get. So notice this is putting out 2.2 watts. So it's really only supposed to be a half a watt. So that's interesting. Let's run it up to channel 12. Not one, 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 two. Okay, so on channel 12, same thing, about 2.21 watts. Let's go up to channel 19. One, 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 eight, one, nine. So on channel 19, you can transmit legally up to 50 watts of transmit power on this, but obviously in a handheld, we're not gonna get anywhere near that. And again, we're at three and a half watts. Let's run up to channel 22. Two, 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 two. And on channel 22, we're transmitting about four watts again. So that is the transmit power for the GMRS radio Baofeng GMRS 9R. Okay guys, so that is the power output of the Baofeng GMRS 9R. Like I said, I really like this radio. It's a waterproof radio. I am a little concerned about it transmitting too much power on eight to 14. I generally stay away from those channels anyway, guys, because I like to transmit full power, especially when I'm out in the woods. I don't think it really matters. The difference between a half a watt and two watts on a handheld this size is really, really minimal unless you're transmitting into a really high gain antenna at high elevation, which I am never doing with a little walkie talkie. So that's my opinion. I'm kind of a rule breaker anyway. If you're a stickler for the rules, just stay off channels eight to 14 if you wanna use this radio and you will be just fine. If you don't care, I don't care. Anyway, I'm gonna put an affiliate link below where you can pick up one of these radios if they're for you. I highly recommend them. And again, check out our full review. Guys, thanks for watching. I'm Kevin with Kemp Outside, your inside source for all things outside. One of the things we're doing here on Kemp Outside is a video series on all the different types of radio communications that you can use when you're outside. We're covering FRS, MERS, GMRS, and ham radio, as well as marine VHF, to tell you about all your different communications options when you're out there. And guess what, guys? You don't have cell phone signal, especially if you're camping with your family or your friends. You want to make sure that you can communicate with each other and with someone else in case of an emergency. So if you're new to radio communications and you're interested in the topic, definitely hit that subscribe button, that little bell icon that notifies you when we release new videos, and give me a thumbs up on this video. Guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Thank you.